So I thought I'd do a little follow-up on the 2000 Blazer. I did get the frame out from underneath of it yesterday. We only had one minor uh, disaster. The sketchiness level was about 29. So this video is more about transmit or not transmission, but brake line and fuel line routing. Uh, mainly for me so that I don't forget on down the road. So here's where your brake master cylinder or actually your brake analog brake actuator attaches in. Comes down, follows the frame, follows the frame, follows the frame, and then it right about at the torsion bar cross member just forward of it is your fuel filter. And that's where your fuel lines all break off. So you've got a fuel return line, a fuel pressure line, a fuel return line. I can't remember which one is which. But there's fuel pressure, fuel return, and vapor. And then you come back here to the front of the gas tank. Got another... Uh, I think that's called a rollover vapor or something. There's a clicky clacker in there that shuts off if you're upside down, which I really don't want to be upside down to test it. And then they all come right back here on top of the frame rail. If that wasn't bad enough, it, when it goes over the wheel arch, you got this rubber flipper flapper flopper in here. And this traps all manner of moisture in here. And you can see this brake line has already been replaced once. This is your main brake line going to the back. And right in here, these corrode because this all holds moisture right here. And this corrodes like crap. I've had two blazers or jimmies blow this brake line out right in this area because of this flipper flapper flopper. Uh, and then you've also got fuel line or vapor fuel vapor and all that crap back in here running running amongst all of this. You've got a little T right here. Got another vapor line coming off the pump. Runs over to this T. Goes into that mess. And then you've got this vapor line. Uh, that is the second one. Yeah, this is vapor. This is vapor. This is fuel return. So this middle line up here looks to be vapor. Let's see, let's trace her back. Doopy 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 doopy. Yes, that is vapor from the charcoal canister back up to the up to the front end. Charcoal canister sat back here. So that's how all of that is routed. If y'all boys want to see anything else about routing before I go ripping and zipping on this thing, let me know and I'll do a video on some other routing stuff. Here's how the uh, front brake lines route. Pretty simple. Follows the front cross member down and across back up right in front of the uh, idler and then loops around right there this has got the gm anti-corrosion system on it so none of this stuff will ever ever rust i mean look at that that is some great anti-corrosion protection right there so give me a big fat thumbs up for taking the time to uh, film this for you until we meet again Y'all drive safe, watch for deer.